Hi everyone, welcome back to Graphic Hunters. In today's video, I'll show you how to create this stunning MH logo inside a hexagon grid using Adobe Illustrator. This step by step tutorial will guide you through building a custom grid, designing the logo, and adding professional finishing touches. So, whether you're a beginner or an experienced designer looking for new techniques, this video has something for you. Let's jump straight into the design process. First, take the Line Segment tool and draw a line. Give it a stroke color. Now select the line and copy it by holding Alt while dragging. Create a total of 11 lines by holding Control and pressing D repeatedly. Okay, that's good. Now select all the lines and align them vertically to the center. While the lines are selected, copy them by pressing Control C and paste them in front using Control F. Go to the Transform panel and rotate these copied lines by 120 degrees. Next, reverse the rotated lines. Right click, select Transform, choose Reflect, and click Copy. Again, copy the selected lines by pressing Ctrl and Ctrl F. Now go back to the Transform panel and set the rotation to zero degrees. Select everything and rotate the lines 90 degrees, just like this. Reduce the stroke width of the lines to make the grid easier to see. Okay, that's fine. We have successfully created the grid for our design today. Now, let's start designing the logo on this grid. First, select the grid and activate the Shape Builder tool. Make sure the Fill Color is turned on. Carefully use the tool to draw the letters of your logo. In our case, the logo letters are M and H, so I'm drawing them here. All right, that's good. As you can see, I've drawn the logo letters. Now, move the design above the grid by holding Shift, selecting the design, and dragging it upward. Once done, delete the grid. You might notice some gaps in the design. This is why I always remind you to be careful when filling each gap in your design, as mistakes can affect the final result. No problem, I'll fix it. Select the design and increase the stroke weight. Then go to Object, select Expand, and click OK. Open the Pathfinder panel, you can find it under the Window menu, and click Unite to merge all the shapes. Now select the design and use the Direct Selection tool. Hold Shift to select three corners of the design and curve them as needed. For this design, I'm setting the corner radius to 20px. Next, select the remaining three corners
and curve them to 29px. OK, that's good. Due to time constraints, I won't add voiceover for the rest of this tutorial. But keep watching carefully. You'll learn many useful techniques as I complete the design. And there you have it, my friends. The M&H logo designed perfectly within a hexagon grid using Adobe Illustrator. I hope you enjoyed following along and learned something new today. If this tutorial helped you, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, I'd love to hear your thoughts or see your own designs inspired by this tutorial, so drop a comment below. And if you're new here, make sure to subscribe to Graphic Hunters for more exciting logo design tutorials and tips every week. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any updates. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.